So now we're on question nine of your UST monthly inspection checklist. You want to make sure that you don't have any water inside of your storage tank. What you're going to use, most of the time what people will use is a gauge stick using water finding paste. I have another tool that I use but it still uses water finding paste. So it's a paste that will change color if there's water found. So you're going to stick whatever tool you're using into your tank until it gets all the way to the bottom with the water finding paste at the bottom of your stick or whatever tool you're using. You want to give it at least 30 seconds for it to react to any water that may be inside your system. After 30 seconds is up, you want to pull your stick or tool out of the tank and check for any coloration difference. Okay, so your water finding paste, if there's water, will change color. In this case, this is a white paste, and if water is applied to it, it turns purple. If there's water inside your tank, you'll see a definite line as to where that water is, and you'll be able to measure how much water is in from that. If the water level inside the tank is half an inch or more, the water needs to be removed within five working days. If the water level reaches two inches, you may not use that tank. You can't sell any of that fuel until that water problem is taken care of.